Well, hey, I don't know about you guys, but I cannot believe that it is back to school season already. And it's looking very different this year and very crazy and even scary for a lot of us. But something that I know a lot of people, including myself, can get excited about is back to school shopping. And so I wanted to make this video and show you guys what I got from the three stores that I went to, Dollar Tree, Target, and Michaels. So let's get into it. So the first back to school supply that I got, I actually didn't buy because I won it from a giveaway. If you guys want to see an unboxing, I have one coming soon. Or if you guys want to see a video on how I won this from a giveaway, um, then let me know in the comments down below. But the first thing that I got is this iPad, this brand new iPad. It is just the iPad 7th generation. Sorry if you can see the window glare on it, but I also got the Apple Pencil with it. And I'm so excited to use it for taking notes. Um, it'll be great for online school. I'm super thankful that I was able to win this from a giveaway. So over here, I have two big bags filled with school supplies and I'm going to get into what I got. So the first thing I got is a brand new pair of Bluetooth headphones because I have a pair and they've been acting up a little bit recently. So I wanted to get a new pair, especially for online school. It'll be super useful. The next thing that I got is this super cute planner from Target. It is by Day Designer and I love the beige color. It is such a pretty neutral and it'll go with anything. Um, I really wanted to have a cute like theme for my school supplies this year and I think that this is so cute and I am definitely a planner. I love to plan out my life and it is super helpful to me to be able to plan out everything and plan out my day, my week, my month, just plan out my life. But I love planning so I just had to get this adorable little planner. So the next two things I got from Michaels and they are these two notebooks. Um, I actually may or may not use these for school because they're like bullet journal kind of things. They're dotted, so I may just use them for journaling, but they are super cute and I'm so excited to use them. Michaels was having a deal, so I got two of them and I just am obsessed with how cute these designs are. So the last thing in that bag is actually from Dollar Tree and it is this super cute headband. I love the headbands that have like the little knot at the top. I love that style and I'm so excited to wear this. Now moving on to the Dollar Tree bag. The first thing that I pulled out is this super cute pencil pouch. It says squeeze the day and it's a lemon. I mean, just how cute is that? Especially for summer, it is just adorable and I love how cute it is and I cannot wait to use it. So the next thing that I got from the Dollar Tree is this pack of mechanical pencils, but they are super cute and I love the designs on them and I thought that would be great to get. Um, I don't know when the last time I used like a number two pencil was, so I should probably do that, but I love mechanical pencils. They are so great and they last for a lot longer, I find. And yeah, I just love mechanical pencils. So the next thing that I pulled out is this pack of pastel highlighters. I just saw these in the Dollar Tree and I was like, I can't believe these are a dollar because I love the colors. They are so cute and it'll make note taking a lot easier. The next thing I picked up was this pack of sticky notes. It's just a little notepad and I just loved the cute little design rather than just like a color. I loved that it actually said notes and had like a gradient in the background and I thought that was so cute so I cannot wait to use that. So the next thing that I got is this sticker pack and I had gotten one of these before and I've used up almost all the stickers. I just think they are so cute and this will definitely make my note taking and school supplies a lot cuter if I can add stickers to them so I bought this pack of stickers. So the next thing I got from the Dollar Tree is this pack 
of five little washi tapes. I love using washi tape and when I saw these, I just thought they are so cute. So I decided to buy them. <laughs> What's next? You already guessed it, more washi tape. It's just so cute and I could not resist. Oh, and what were you expecting? More washi tape. <laughs> Honestly, what were we expecting? I love washi tape. Um, yeah. The next thing that I picked up from the Dollar Tree is this pack of binder clips. These can be super helpful, especially for keeping all your papers together. So I'm definitely going to be using these. The next thing I got is this cute little roll of more tape. It is the cutest little pattern of washi tape and I'm just so excited to use it. If you guys can't tell, I kind of have a thing for washi tape. So the next thing I got will not only be helpful for my room, but also for school because um, I don't know about you guys, but a lot of schools are doing online. I know some people are going back in person, but a lot are doing online. So this is going to be super helpful to be able to have more outlets at my desk and then I can plug all of my things in that I need to use. So the next thing I got is this note card pack but what I loved about it rather than just getting a bunch of note cards is that it's in a little ring thing so you can just flip and I thought that would be so helpful for studying um I don't know it's super cute and I think it'll be great for studying for tests or anything like that so I had to buy it and last but not least I got this adorable pencil pouch from the Dollar Tree I love the little bear design on it and I love this color green. I love olive green. It's one of my favorite colors. So of course I had to get it. And yeah, that is the last thing that I got from the Dollar Tree. Altogether, all of this stuff was about $40, which is not bad for everything that I got. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching this haul. I really enjoyed filming it and make sure you leave a like, subscribe to my channel and comment down below what you're excited about for this school year because I know that it can be hard to find something exciting with all of the circumstances right now. So comment something that you can think of that you're excited about for this upcoming school year. And yeah, I will see you guys in my next video.